Hello everyone, I'm Brandon Larkin and welcome back to Slender The Arrival. So today, we are going to be continuing this and hopefully finishing it as well. Last time I kind of ended the video abruptly but we got to the more intense half of the game. Uh, we did this really awkward part where I kind of just sat there and cried. And then, yeah, we're on escape. So I'm just checking we're on normal still because it doesn't let me do hardcore yet. So yeah, we'll be continuing this from here. So, we've got a very intense start to the video, actually, when you think about it. Because, man, this one, this one's hard. Well, it's not really hard, but it's just, you know, it's intense. It's very loud and I can't control the volume on these and they're on the highest one. So, yeah. Put that into perspective. Alright, so basically we just gotta close all the windows. Oh, and doors. Close all the doors too. Don't forget them doors. That's very important. Right. Window. There we go. So obviously you've got the... The happy music playing in the background. Oh, I'm scared. I'm gonna close that. Thank you. Right. Okay. Have I forgot any windows? Holy fuck! He got in. Oh my god. I need to hide in my room. Holy shit, that scared me. Nice. Let's go. Shut that. Oh. Oh my god. Head first through that window. Kate is a warrior. We now have my... Well, in my opinion, the scariest. Many of you will probably agree. Right. So the way this is going to work is... Um, oh. See you. Yeah, so I'm going to say again, actually, before I forget, that I will not be getting collectibles in this playthrough. I'll be doing that in the next one. Well, actually, I think I'll be doing the speed run in the next one and doing the collectibles last. Um, but let me know if I should change that around, of course. So, yeah, I'm hoping to get some more achievements today. I've got a few in mind that I might be able to get. So, yeah, I'm actually kind of nervous, really, because, well, this one is, is pretty damn scary. Right, so, just to keep in mind, there's a creepy motherfucker around here that you might see walking through these corridors. I seem to have got lucky this time, but you might see him just stood there. Just know, right? He cannot hurt you. He can't. So, just to keep in mind, this silo actually cannot harm you either, it's just creepy noises. But this is where it gets intense. Um, I don't like this part. <laughs> it's just, it makes me very nervous. I'm just walking here because I need to save my breath because, yep, I've got to run away from something. Yep, you heard me right. Okay, so that blue bastard that keeps chasing me everywhere. Well, I'm going to have to watch out for him. Right, and run. I'm just running. Holy shit. 
See what I mean? Like, the music's kind of scary. Um, I don't really know whether it's behind me or not. And I don't really want to find out. But I think we made it. We're good. We're in. Nice. Now we're going to get these toys off the floor. Oh, fuck. He's gone. Okay. So listen very carefully. This guy can't jump. So we're just going to wait. He's going to go in there and we're going to drop down. Oh. Sneaky. Check it. And we're running to another house now. Where we're then going to have to run away again. Which is fun, of course. Shut that. Right, so we're gonna run upstairs, ignoring the collectibles because there's like a couple up here, I think. Yeah, there's one there, look. I'm gonna drop down and he's gonna come out of one of these doors. So you're just gonna have to fucking run, okay? Just, just run. But it's alright because what happens next is meant to happen. That's the guy just dropping his camera. <laughs> It gets picked up at the end. Okay, so we can stay calm for a little bit now. We don't actually have anything else yet for a minute. We just have to try and navigate around this mountain and find the right way. So you're going to have to bear with me here. I know that it's not like the way that it looks like. In fact, I think it's up here. I believe you go over there and then down here. Oh yeah. That was pretty quick. So. There's another achievement coming up for me. I think that. I'm going to be able to get it. Put it that way. Basically, I've got to not get set on fire. And I know you're probably thinking, what the fuck? But you'll see what I mean in a minute, because shit's about to go red. See what I mean, right? <laughs> Check it. Right, so not only do you nearly get set on fire in this, but you also get bummed. And this isn't... Oh, Fuck! Oh! Motherfucker got set on fire! Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck it. I'm gonna get another achievement instead then. Where's Slenderman? Where's Slenderman? Where are you when I need you? There he is. Come on. Give me your tentacles. Give me your tentacles, plus. You're wasting my time. Do I have to get closer? He's running away from me. He's up there. Come back. I want you. Come on. Come on. Oh, what? Oh, so you got to actually run into him. Who would have thought I'd be chasing after Slenderman? What the flying hell? Where is he? Where did you go? Oh, he's there. Come here, buddy. Come on. Come on. Oh, for fuck's sake. And now he's back that He's trolling me now. Can you not see that I want to die? Oh, I've got him. Oh, I think I might have got too close for the achievement. You're probably thinking, what the hell was I doing for about five minutes? Basically, there's an achievement for getting ensnared by his testicles. And I thought I'd go for that since I got set on fire. And I think I'm going to keep doing that because 
well, I need to get both of them at some point. And this fire one can be tricky because we're in the woods and you've actually got to run through trees. And if you didn't know, fire spreads to trees. Especially when there's lots of them. So be careful. Just make sure that you do your observations. Oh, fuck off. You know if he gets me now, I will be really pissed. I gave you a chance, Slenderman. You had your chance. Oh, it's there. Right, you gotta head for that tower. You understand? But you gotta avoid him. And you gotta avoid the fire with everything you've got. Oh, fuck. Oh, do I want to do that, though? What, what, what else have I got to... I'm going to have to. Oh, fuck. It's risky. Oh, we're nearly there, though. Oh, shit. Fuck off. Oh. What don't you understand? Oh, I'm nearly there though. Nearly there, boys. I don't think I've been set on fire yet either. Which is also good. Oh, there it is. There's the door. Oh, come on. Yeah, motherfucker. Um. Achievement. Oh, for fuck's sake. Maybe I get it at the end. You know what? Right, be careful here because for some reason you get fucking killed. Sometimes. Only sometimes. Oh shit, it's alright, I survived. Nice. You didn't fail me. Oh. Okay. I'm just gonna sit here now and awkwardly listen to it. Okay, that went out rapid. Oh, fuck! I forgot about that. So in this case, I actually need to get two collectibles. Because otherwise I can't progress. So, oh yeah, and it's this one here. Um, I don't really read the collectibles. I don't really care what they have to say. But now, we just walk around here. It sounds kind of like a porno. Oh. There she is. Come on, buddy. Well, that was predictable. And he's sliding away. That's a pretty impressive skill. Yay! Oh, I did get that achievement. Nice. Oh. Holy fuck. Holy shit. I got three achievements. So, I made it through the forest fire. Oh, shit. 
without catching on fire once. I beat the game in under 45 minutes, which I didn't think I was going to get, but I did, so nice. And I also beat the game on normal. And now, I can play the game on, um, I think I can play it on hardcore. Oh, I can. And I think that I also have a new level called Genesis. So we're going to go straight into this on hardcore and see what we can do. Because there is an achievement for beating Genesis and an achievement for beating it on hardcore. So for those of you who are not aware, this is a... Um, this was the original Slender. Well, before the game had a sequel. And you know what I mean. I'm going to use the same strategy though as I normally would and get this shit out of the way because as well similar to the eight pages level on this game you have to fucking find your shit and you don't oh I'm monging out I don't know why but my English is not very good today that is taking the piss to find this and that's not good because the fact that I'm on hardcore means that my flashlight can run out of battery. Yep, you heard me right. I'm not bullshitting you. I think it can appear on the outside. Maybe it can't. Let's head back in. Okay, well, I'm going to use this then to look at the spots. Alright, that one's a hard one. In fact, let me have a look. Is there an achievement for speedrunning this? If there is, I'm starting again. Beat Genesis on Hardcore. Is there one for beating Genesis on... Well, in general, I don't think there is, is there? Um, no, there isn't a speedrun one. So you know what? Let's get this popping. I trust myself. But he's gonna be mad. Alright. Because this is hardcore. This is my first time playing hardcore in a long, long time. Just check this. Could be pretty much anywhere. I mean, he could be. Well, it's not on there then, is it? Get the flashlight off. We don't have a lot of battery. There he is. My guy. Yep, that's right, Slenderman. Taking your pages. What are you going to do? Oh, big tree. Oh, he's going to be triggered though. He's getting real pissed now. He's like, am I a duke? Like, I just did that right in front of him. How's he even... Oh. Are you telling me this? Oh, there is. I was going to say, there needs to be a page on the big tree. That's like my favourite location ever. Oh, is that a... It's a landmark. I see it. I can see the page. But Slenderman can too. Pop. I think because I started this so late, I'm just going to have no power on my flashlight. And it's going to be so much harder. I'm just going to ignore the fact that he's right there. Don't be like me. Don't be reckless. I didn't see anything on them rocks. But I need to go in here really because... Well, this just... I should have tackled this as one of my first ones, actually. Because, oh, we're good. Let's just get out of there. Save my flashlight up. Let's head over here. Got another landmark. We're doing decent. Getting the pages. Don't really matter what speed we get the pages. Oh. Right. Anything? Always there. You telling me there's nothing on here? You dicks. Oh my god! Holy fuck, I didn't realise how scary this one was. Holy Jesus. Run! 
Oh, ho, ho. I've got six. Oh no, we've done a circle. Oh my god, he's right there. Oh, Slenderman Plus. Don't do this. I don't want your pages, I just want my achievement. Oh, oh, it's that shitty van. Oh, he's there. He's took a few steps back at least. But he's still pretty fucking... Oh, he's there. I'm just... Oh! Okay, there was a page on there. So, what's that? What the fuck is that? Oh, that's a tree. I'm kind of scared. Oh, and I'm back here again. What a shithole. Oh, we're back at the rocks. I hate the rock. Okay, the rock is okay. The rocks. Not so good, is there? Holy Jesus. There's not a page on there. I looked on every wall. This has taken a while. I'm restarting. Yes. Good start. Oh, I see it. Always get them to first. If I could give you some advice, it would be that. I think this way is probably going to be better, actually. We're getting these pretty darn quick. Taking the harder ones first. Oh yeah. It's looking good. It's looking real good. But it's there. But that's okay because it's there. It's not here. He's there. T in front of it. He's probably going to be here soon. Yep, he's following me. I think Slenderman knows there's a page at these rocks. And I don't think he's going to be very happy about that. There isn't. Well, if there is... I ain't got time to look because Slender Man is horny as fuck. Oh yeah. Oh, I think there is one here though. He seems really protective over this silo. Oh, he is. That's why. Oh, what's wrong, Slender Man? I thought I had seven pages, but I only have five. Lol. That's kind of funny. For some, I don't know why I thought I had seven. Like now, when I think about it, why did I think that at all? I just realised I've left one of the harder ones still last, though. But don't worry, we like a challenge, don't we? Come on, car, truck, weird building. You're gonna give me a. Oh my God, he's right there. You cheeky goose. Well, what am I gonna do? Oh, ho, ho. oh, he pissed. Oh, I see your page. Oh, that's why you're mad, isn't it, buddy? Oh, now I've got seven. Oh, this is like the angriest he's gonna get. <laughs> and I think I know where the last page is. And I'm really not happy about it. He's pissed. We know that. Here it is. Right, we're gonna approach this here instead of going through the middle of him. Cause I'm gonna. Oh! I'm gonna have to be careful. I'm gonna have to be. Oh shit! Oh yeah! Take that, Slenderman. Oh, what's your issue? Am I the god? Oh, I think I am. Nice. Beat the Genesis level on hardcore. 
Nice job. Okay, so I'm going to end that video there because I've been recording for 35 minutes. I'm going to have to shorten that down quite a bit, I imagine. Um, but I'm happy to have completed Genesis on Hardcore. And in the next video, I'm going to be playing from the beginning in Hardcore, seeing what we can do and how easy it is to get to the end. Probably be quite Hardcore to get to the end. It'd be weird if it wasn't. And I'm also going to find out some more secret achievements and get them uploaded. So, thank you everybody for watching till the end, and bye.